Greetings everyone, Sir Morgan here from the technical department. From the topic isometric projection, you will learn to draw the third isometric drawing in this series. To the given dimensions, you will now draw your isometric projection. Use your T-square and draw a horizontal baseline. Now with the use of your T-square along with your Z-square, draw a perpendicular line to intersect this horizontal line. From this intersection, draw a line inclined at an angle of 30 degree. Repeat this procedure on the other side of the intersection. Now measure and identify 80 millimeters from the intersection on this line. Now on this vertical line, you will measure and identify 40 millimeters from the intersection. You will now measure and identify 50 millimeters from the intersection on this line. Now from the 50 millimeter point you last identified, Use your set square along with your T-square to draw a vertical line from this point. Now from the 80mm point you identified earlier, draw a vertical line from this point. Now from this point, with the use of your 30 degree set square, draw this horizontal line. Again with the use of your T-square along with your set square, Draw another horizontal line from this point. Remember to always hold your T-square firmly against your drawing table. Now from this intersection, you will draw another horizontal line inclined at 30 degree. Use your T-square and your set square always. With the use of your T-square and your set square, draw a line from this point inclined at an angle of 30 degree. You have just completed your isometric rectangle. Now you will measure and identify 20 millimeters on this line from this point. On the other end of the line, also measure and identify 20 millimeters also. Now use your set square along with your T square to draw vertical lines from the two 20 millimeter points you previously identified. Now measure and identify 10 millimeters from this point. This can be done on any of the two previous lines drawn. Now use your T-square along with your Z-square to draw this line inclined at 30 degree from this point. Now draw the final line from this point using your Z-square and your T-square. Excellent! Now outline the given isometric projection you have just constructed. You may now border your paper and complete your title block. 